How to improve your karate sparring. First things first, there's no substitute for experience. And what experience will bring you more than anything else in sparring is a reflexive reaction to every situation that could exist. So in my dojo, I encourage a lot of uh, sparring that's very, that's not cooperative, but it's very conversational almost. And uh, someone, one of my teachers once spoke about, you know, sparring in the dojo should be much more of a conversation than, a, than an argument. So you don't want to be butting heads all the time because you can't continue that for two, three, four minutes, let alone 10 minutes or, or even 20 minutes. And uh, when I was in Japan, I had a fortunate position to have a great champion who was junior to me. So he couldn't impose um, too much his assertiveness on me. And I wasn't the sort of senior to just want to bully him. So I would use him and his ability to be able to spar for 20 minutes or, or more with no injuries and no risk of injuries. We were just really exchanging many, many techniques and our bodies, rather than our intellect, would gradually start to perceive uh, what was appropriate at what moment. So when you're moving around, and this is true with all our techniques, you want to be feeling the ground, driving off the ground and keeping all your limbs available for blocking and countering, for seeking from one block or one technique to another, for the ebb and flow of attack and counter-attack and defense. So practicing regularly as Alex and I are doing here, and you can see we're actually enjoying ourselves, you know, this is not a fight. This is really gaining reflex of the moment. And that's how I consider we can improve our sparring. Thank you.